Hi there, so today we are gonna learn about how to do some cool stuff with Python PIL library and now we are creating and editing uh, some images and we I'm gonna put that image in my logo I have already done that so uh, this is my logo and I have created this image from this and I have created this image in PixArt and uh, this value this color value is 255 comma 255 comma 255 it is typical white color uh, this information is we are gonna use so, so I mentioned it and uh, the resolution of this image is 2100,2100 it's uh, huge and uh, uh, you, you are gonna come to know why the resolution is that much bigger so let's start with the coding part uh, I have already written some code uh, which is from my last video that is gradient let's just run this code it takes time because uh, the value over here is 200 2100 comma 2100 uh, means the loop will execute for 2100 into 2100 times so as you can see that that was the gradient part as the flash screen mentioned now we have this image and now we want to open this image first so let's just say bi equals to image dot open let's just copy and paste to the path ok let me just copy this ok then for i in range 2100 for j in range Two one double zero. K equals bi dot get pixel. I comma j. Is there any end? If k equals equals two five five comma two five five comma two five five comma two five five. Uh, remember this: if you are having a PNG image, then you need to provide four arguments, and if you are having JPG image, you need to provide three arguments. Put pixel, and that put pixel is as same as what we have created the gradient so I'm just pasting it rather than getting that place from putting this let's just say bi dot show so over here what we have done is we have uh, we get go get the values of every pixel and when the pixel is white that is 255 comma 255 comma 255 we are replacing those values with the gradient values at that place at that i and j place so this is the gradient that we have created using this and we have the image that is this so every time the value is white it replaces the value from this gradient thing so we are replacing this white area with this gradient area The code will take quite a long to run because the loop is 2100 into 2100 times and it is running two times in this program so it will definitely take quite a long time to execute this file.
with the brilliant design. Okay, so done. Uh, so we have created our logo with this thing. Uh, basically, we are re we have replaced this white area with the gradient part. Uh, so I have already told you about the two five five thing. So you can use any color. You can use any color in Blender, but just make sure what pixel you are replacing. Now uh, about the size means I have told you that the size must be larger. Uh, the reason behind that was the pixel things uh, does with the square things means every time you are using the picture let's let let us show you this picture is with with 900 comma 900 let's just open this pic let me just give the properties yeah it's in jpg format so pic dot jpg let's just delete this thing so that it won't get executed and will get output in quite few time and then just run it yeah as i told you this picture was in 900 comma 900 thing so at the edge uh, the pixel just desorted or we can say it, it doesn't execute it well the reason behind that is pixel is something in a square so at edge uh, it recognizes it but it doesn't exactly put pixel to that thing because it's not exactly what it edge. so we are running this code on some larger image so even if we zoom it we can see this things also but it's negligible because the pixels are 2100 cross 2100 so it just too wider to notice the small mistakes and small corrections so make sure you are running with some larger image so that the, uh, the errors are quite negligible uh, thank you so much for watching the video hopefully it was worth watching and uh, do creative things with the python and pl library because it was worth and it is something that you can do it means you can create this image in uh, pixar you can create many images in pixar then create some background cool background gradient or anything then just replace your image and replace that color and gradient give gradient to it give few amazing so thank you so much for watching the video press the bell icon and subscribe please